Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Ama does this. In today's video, I'm going to be seeing if we can make a profit from an Alolan Executor V collection box. He's retail for twenty one ninety nine in the UK, and we're going to see if we can make a profit from any of the contents in this box. So without further ado, let's get it. So here's your call card and the Alolan Executor V promo card. I'll throw up a price on screen as well, how much the promo itself is worth. Here is the jumbo card. These probably aren't worth too much. But so far I've seen from these um, Cloning Executable Boxes, Executable Boxes have decent pulls, like some really good pulls. So, hopefully that can also be my case but I'm doubting it I'm doubting it all right so here's your first pull card and let's get into the first pack so I've opened up quite a bit of the these Pokemon Go products now guys and I've very close to completing the master set but at this point for me chasing what I need left for the master set is gonna be tough so I'm just seeing I'm sort of reverse charge like, yes Speaking of Master Set, I need this for the Master Set as well. Perfect. So far with all of these profit videos, I've pulled at least one. At least one card for the Master Set. So it works out for me in a sense. But at the same time, it's more so seeing if I can make a profit. So I can put it back in to buy more products to do more for the Master Set. But so far, out of all of these profit and loss videos I've done, I've done the Radiant Eevee. And an elite trainer box. This one here is an Alolan executor box. But all have been decent. All have been decent. I wouldn't know yet because I'm doing it all in one setting. I wouldn't know really the prices. But when I edit it, obviously I'll throw up prices and stuff like that. But I think only one of them so far. Which was the nice. That helps a lot as well with this box. In terms of profit wise. Now Mil, these reverse dittos. If you don't peel them, selling for quite a bit. Lost Toys Hollow. Actually, let's leave that up. But yeah, I think of all of the profit and loss videos I've done, the Elite Trainer box is probably the best one so far. Even though I'm, even though I say Elite Trainer boxes probably are the ones I would say not to go for. Reading Eevees, I believe, I would say are the best ones to go for. Spot, Aridos, Blanche. Oversaw, Kadav, Magikarp, Melton, Eevee, Lost Philosopher. Third time I've pulled this card now, guys. I mean, we've got a full art, so that helps towards the profit and loss, but each time I pull something like this, a full art, this could have been something for the monster set. Could have been Dragonite, could have been one of the old arts. But nope. Third time I've pulled that one. So that's not too bad. That's really gonna help, I think, with the profit in this box. Even though I say that, I don't think. Nah, it's not even gonna be in profit yet. Don't think that even will bring it into profit margin. Candy, love it. Naughty, Amico. Opo, Onyx, Reverse Blastoise, and another Blastoise, Double Blastoise guys, Double Blastoise. And knowing that that was going to be disappointing guys, we have another one. Alright guys, here's your call cards, here's your call cards. And four extra packs, let's see if we can make a profit from this one. So, first box I feel like, nope, no profit, let's see if second box we can make a profit cold card leaf energy blanche steel it water tool numel golden raticate tranquil oversaw na2 reverse spinner and mutual v1 do you know what i just realized i think i've only pulled this card twice maybe three times out of 100 plus plus packs I believe this is only the second time I've seen it. 
Now that I think about it. I did a booster box. And I don't remember seeing it in that booster box. And if I can think about it now, I've only ever pulled it once. I think I've only ever pulled it once. Well, this card is actually quite rare. I can't believe it. Well, now that, now that I think about it, that Mewtwo. Wow. Is it that rare? For V, it's actually quite rare. I've pulled a lot of the rest. But that Mewtwo V, I've actually barely pulled. Just thinking about it now. From 100 plus packs. I think right now I'm on probably 120 packs. And that's like the second or maybe the third time I've seen it. Alright, two packs left guys, two packs left. So far, boy. These Alolan executor bosses aren't going profit wise in my case. I think the only way to really make a profit from all of these from any of these products is uh, for the Radiant Zard or the or Mewtwo. I think those two are the only ones really that you're gonna make a profit from. Alright, last pack guys, last pack will we get last pack magic, will we get last pack magic? So after this video guys, I'd have the team special collection boxes to open to see if we can make a profit loss out of that. But as well, um, it won't be a profit loss but I do have the Pokemon Center Elite Trainer boxes coming soon. So we'll have those. But wow, this, this box was a dud. 1v, 1v, that was a dud. Right guys, so I will put an insert of prices for both boxes somewhere up here, maybe. But I think we're gonna be in a loss for both box for both boxes. For me, I pulled the reverse Charizard, which is actually good for me and the normal. But apart from that, guys, that's the profit or loss of the uh, Lowland Executive V box. If you enjoyed the video, if you stuck with me to the end, I'd appreciate if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more, and I'll see you on the next one.